Hey guys, so I went out to the range yesterday and I got a chance to put my hands on my uh, my 10.5 build. Uh, one of the things that happened was because I bought a cheap knockoff. I don't know if you can see it. I bought a cheap knockoff three prong and it decided to explode. So I uh, I learned my lesson there and I replaced it with a uh, Strike Industries J Comp, which uh, was pretty phenomenal. I put up some uh, some videos of uh, how well it performed at the end of the day. Um, another problem I ran into is because I tried out that 22 uh, long rifle conversion, I had some uh, some binding inside my bolt area. However, after closer inspection, what I thought was a dirty weapon, I actually found out that my gas tube there uh, was slightly bent to the, uh, the left side of the receiver as you look uh, down the sights. So what I ended up doing was taking some time and uh, using some manpower and rebending that uh, and replacing it. So now <clears throat> the bolt locks up perfectly without any resistance at all. So I'm pretty happy about that. Uh, the optic was phenomenal. I had no issues there. Um, perfect at about 50 yards. I was zeroing it, which gives me uh, at 100, about a two inch drop. So I'm fine with that. This is mainly and primarily considered a, a close quarters weapon. Uh, however, for me, it's just fun. Um, the Airgro grips were great. They kept uh, all of the heat away from my hands, and I love this uh, angle foregrip. I was using P-Mags primarily, but I also had some OK and uh, Surefeed mags. I cannot speak enough about how amazing this SBA3 uh, brace is. I tried it as a brace, putting my arm through the hole, and I also tried it uh, monetarily touching my shoulder and both were absolutely phenomenal in acceptance uh, and I loved it. Um, the trigger smoothed out a lot over about 400 rounds um, and I had a, a great range day. I'll post some pictures and videos of uh, the range day um, and I'll see you guys later. All right, thanks.